All right, when you think of Botox, you most likely think of it as a cure for uh, smoothing away wrinkles. If you would imagine it could help patients struggling to rebuild their lives from a debilitating medical attack. Tonight, Liz Reyes shows us the surprising Botox benefits. They're happening right here in New Orleans. At age 29, New Orleanian Sarah Abruzli was living a fabulous full life with her husband Damien. The professional ballerina was also fulfilling her dream on stage, performing around the world. Then in September of 2007, she says she awoke with the worst headache of her life. So I stand up from my bed and already the left side of my body is paralyzed. But in fact, I didn't realize it. I began to walk and I realized I'm not walking very well. Her husband rushed her to a nearby emergency room where hours later, they would learn she had suffered a stroke. Everybody knew me as Sarah the ballerina, but suddenly here I am unable to dance. The stroke rendered the entire left side of my body unusable, completely paralyzed in fact. Sarah says an abnormality with blood vessels in her brain caused a stroke that shattered her life. Doctors say strokes are like a storm in your brain, interrupting your normal blood flow of much needed oxygen, resulting in paralysis. Sarah, though, was determined to reclaim her body, as you see here in this video of her physical therapy right after her stroke. You're doing great. Thank you. Her perseverance paid off. Within a month, she was walking again, but with limitations on her left side. Her left arm, for example, was unusable. Her muscles were so tight, she could not open her tight-fisted hand. It is a condition known as spasticity. But that changed last year when she started a new, unlikely treatment. It's this, Botox, the popular cosmetic product normally used for smoothing out wrinkles. It would be one needle stick right here. Except in this case, Botox injections in Sarah's arm every three to four months proved it's not just for preserving youthfulness, but also useful in restoring life in limbs of stroke victims. More and more my fingers are relaxed. Every day I can very readily take my wedding ring on and off. The Botox also helped improve her walking for her job as a concierge at a local hotel. When the injections relaxed the tightness in the muscles of her left hand, it also helped improve her overall balance. Some of my patients are surprised when I mention Botox. But Sarah's physician, Dr. Andrea Toomer, says her stroke patients grappling with restricted movement in their arms and legs are quickly convinced of its value once they see results in a week. At the Calicia Neurological Clinic, she uses a Botox treatment on at least 20 patients. So if you were affected, let's say, in your right arm and you can't relax your arm, we can use the Botox at a pretty high dose to relax that muscle so that you're not left very tight and unable to relax on your own. Although doctors here at this West Bank Clinic have been using Botox for non-cosmetic reasons since 2001, it really wasn't widely known among other doctors and patients for use specifically for stroke victims. That's because only recently the manufacturer two years ago started marketing Botox for that particular use. And helping get the word out on this are physicians like Dr. Toomer, who believe many other local patients can benefit from this treatment. So many patients whose family members can't open their hand, their, their hands are like this, and you can imagine, how do you cut your fingernails? How do you wash your hand? You're open to a lot of infection by being like this. Yeah, that was the tight part that she was trying to work on some. And then your fingers. Loosen up your bicep, push it way out. There you go. Slidell residents Joe Pastorak and his son Jeremy know all too well the benefits of Botox injections in treating the devastating impacts of a stroke. This was the then 28-year-old before his stroke. He was a law student at Mississippi College, but shortly after undergoing heart surgery three years ago, a blood clot formed and he suffered a massive stroke that paralyzed the left side of his body. Then he says it got worse. His wife left him. With tears rolling down his face in his now monotone voice caused by the stroke, the 31-year-old describes his life now. Hell. Seriously, hell. 
because I'm so miserable. I have no independence. I can't even make food. Left foot, Left foot. Right. right foot. In spite of Jeremy's heartbreaking new reality, though, his father says his treatment of Botox injections have helped him make progress, and it's given him hope of having use of his left arm. Whenever you ma manipulate his arm and try to stretch it out, keep it from contracting, he would feel pain. And now you can do a lot with his arm, and he doesn't really feel any pain from it. Push me across the room. Good. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep your head straight. In the case of 57-year-old New Orleanian Carolyn Lewis, she's new to the treatment, about six months in. But already she's looking forward to getting more independence because of the Botox injections. I will be able to use like a regular can opener to open the can. At one time I had to wait for someone to either come home or just be in the house with me before I could get a can open to be able to put my hands up and work in my head. That's sometimes I just long to do that for myself. For patients like Carolyn, Jeremy and Sarah, you can call their medical injections a surprising Botox benefits. I want to shoot a commercial and say, well, I do look great. I do get Botox in my fingers. Their hope is that other stroke survivors too will have as much success as they have had using a cosmetic product that's helping them reclaim some control of their bodies and their lives. Liz Reyes, Fox 8 News. Right now, Louisiana has one of the highest rates in the nation of stroke attacks, so many people in the state can benefit from this. The physicians say the treatment is covered by insurance, so if you'd like more information, we do have a link posted on our website. Just head over to fox8live.com.